if you can draw the human body, if you don't struggle with it and you understand it and you're really good at it, you can draw anything. I always had an interest in the naturism or social nudity. And one of the fellows that I knew, he was taking an art course at um, in the Pian Sportsplex. And he says, you know, Howard, you should model. I said, what do you mean model? I said, that's young, you know, good looking people. And he said, well, for one thing, your face is fantastic for drawing. So I gave it a try. I, I have people who like me in these different groups. Like this face of mine is, for, for, for an artist, it's, it's really something. It's not even equal. And even these ears are, you know, there's a lot of prominent features here. So we have to finish the head, right? The structure of the head. We only did it to about halfway, I believe, right? And it's very different than the, uh, than the photography modeling, I find, because the poses are longer and um, you have to be more in tune with your body and, and understand yourself. It's very interesting to see um, how others see me. Um, it's kind of interesting to walk around and look at the different angles of, uh, of everybody's um, sketches and things like that. I think that it's really helpful for artists to um, do this type of, of classical drawing. It's, it's kind of like a lot of things in our culture. I feel as though I want to keep those traditional art forms going. And if I can do that by being a life model, then I would like to help out so that the, it's like a tradition doesn't die. I had a friend who, uh, she said, you know, Ella, I could picture you being an art model. And I, I knew that it was, um, a lot of the fine art models are nude. And I was a bit offended by that because at that point I, I had never done anything like that before. But I went to one of her um, drawing groups at the Sandy Hill, which still is running. And I saw all the beautiful artwork that was being made from 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 the model posing and there were about 30 artists and I thought that that was something that I really wanted to do and uh, I talked to the instructor and I said uh, oh I have lots of experience art modeling like you should hire me for this and then a few weeks later that was my first my very first time posing I've I've been modeling for so long now that I'm not really I don't really have to think about how to pose or where to pose I just I know how to angle my body in a way that is appealing to the artists that are looking for lines and shapes and and shadows and and really interesting curves and um, I think that 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 part just comes naturally to me where an, uh, a new model might be thinking about like oh where do I put my hands or how do I stand this way and uh, you get yourself into some uncomfortable positions early on when you're an art model and then you never put yourself in those positions again, like where your leg might fall asleep or you're putting too much weight on, on one arm. So I've, I've worked out all of those kinks over time. I almost sneezed during one of the uh, poses and I think that that's a pretty funny thing that can happen to you, <laughs> especially nude. <laughs>